Better Bites episode two. And today, we're gonna live moss as Taco Bell says it. Everyone raves and rants about the Crunchwrap Supreme. So that is what we're gonna beat today. We're gonna beat the Crunchwrap Supreme and make a better bite. So the one question I have for you today is, who's hungry? All right, people, so we're in the car, headed to Taco Bell. We're living Moss with the glasses today. Not a lie, this is super dangerous, driving with this thing and holding it, but stay tuned. And here we go, Taco Bell. Hi, how are you? How you doing? Can I get a two Crumb Strap Supremes, please? Would you like to have extra beef for 50 cents each? Yeah, let's do it. Why here you not? go, Miss Monica. Huh? I was talking to somebody else. Oh. It's gonna be 11.33, see you at the window. Thank you. Sheesh. Thank you. So we're doing a YouTube channel thing here. I'm remaking these crunch wrap things here. Do you care to be on camera or no? I'll you don't be on camera? Say hi to the camera here. No, no, no. <laughs> you don't want to be on camera. Oh, that's quick. Well, thank you so much. Have a good one. And we got the crunch wraps. First, let's just kind of see what we're working with here. So this is the bag that it comes in. We have some hot sauce and our beloved Crunchwrap Supreme. Take it out of the bag. And this is what everyone goes crazy for. And don't get me wrong, I absolutely love these things. Cut it in half. And that is what's inside the Crunchwrap Supreme. And I ordered double beef on this. I had to try to give them the benefit of the doubt. And this is what I'm left with. No meat inside of this. Maybe this little thin, little layer. But we'll give them the benefit of the doubt. We'll do a taste test here. It's not really any crunch. Like, no crunch at all. No seasoning. Kind of soggy. And I just got these. I literally just got these. All I know is we're about to blow these absolutely out of the water. To make this crunch wrap supreme, we're not taking any shortcuts here. First, we're gonna ground our own beef. This beef is gonna consist of some short ribs and it's gonna consist of some bottom round steak. So first, what you're gonna wanna do is debone all of your meat and then you're gonna wanna cut your steak into manageable sized pieces so it fits in this hole right here. And for a cheap steak, that has some pretty good marbling if you ask me. And you wanna alternate between the short rib and the steak. And that is what you're left with for ground beef. And this looks so much better than the shit that you buy at the store. 100% ground your own beef, people. So the second thing we're gonna do is make the toppings. So it's gonna consist of a lettuce slaw with some cilantro and lime, and then we have our normal tomatoes, and then we're gonna make a chipotle mayo sour cream sauce, uh, I guess a chipotle crema, um, that we're gonna put on top of it that's gonna take place of the actual sour cream that the Crunchwrap Supreme has on it. For your lettuce slaw, you're gonna get one head of iceberg lettuce, some olive oil, salt, ground pepper, some lime, and some cilantro, and a splash of rice vinegar. Moving on, we have two Roma tomatoes. We're gonna make a chipotle creme that's gonna go on top of the crunch wrap. Um, that's gonna take place as a sour cream. Some sour cream, touch of mayo, half of a habanero pepper de-seeded. Some cilantro, some chipotle chili powder, paprika, garlic powder, salt, ground pepper, and a splash of lemon juice. And one avocado to just put on top. Oil your pan a little bit, put a, gen a generous amount of ground beef. Salt ground pepper, chili powder, garlic powder, cumin, and some cayenne pepper. Scoop your ground beef out and try to get as much fat out of the ground beef as possible and let it drain. So the Crunchwrap Supreme is all about the crunch that Talk About clearly didn't get right today. So what we're gonna do to get that crunch is we're gonna get a yellow corn tortilla and fry it in some 
chili oil. The chili oil is gonna enhance the flavor of this plain tortilla and it's gonna be absolutely outrageous the end result of this thing. So what we're gonna do is get this chili oil. This has been in a bunch of my recipes. All the taco recipes use this oil. Coat the bottom of the pan and we're gonna lay our tortilla down in this ripping hot oil and let it fry. And you're looking for something that looks just like that. And just to show you guys kind of what you want it to sound like is just nice, crispy corn tortilla in the middle. That's gonna give it so much flavor when you bite into it. All right, now it's time to assemble the Crunch Wrap Supreme. First, you wanna start with the biggest flour tortilla that you can find and put a generous amount of meat topping the tortilla. Good guideline to use is the crunch in the middle. You kind of wander around that size. Topped with some Monterey Jack cheese, some sharp cheddar. Proceed to torch your cheese if you have a torch. Topped with your crunch in the middle, chipotle crema. Topped with your lettuce, tomatoes, and a few slices of avocado. You want to get a second tortilla, get a circle, and cut around the outside. Get your crunch wrap, put this on top. What you want to do is fold each individual side like this. So it looks just like a little present. You want to get a large pan, put a splash of oil on the bottom, and seam side down, place it on the pan, just like that. All right, so once it's been cooking for a little bit, it's time to flip. Look at that, look at that, perfect. Beautiful. All right, so this is what we made. Look at that thing. Absolutely beautiful, nicely charred, like a thick, heavy. And let's just put it up to a comparison of the other one. This is Taco Bell's. Just look at the difference there. Look at the difference in size there is. It's absolutely outrageous. But I'm absolutely dying to take a bite of this thing. And just a comparison, look at the cross section here. This is Taco Bell's. You guys ready for this? Look at that. And just a side-by-side -side comparison of the difference. Finally, it's time to eat these things. I'm so excited. Here we go. This is just a different league of crunch wrap. It's so much better. And that's why it's a better bite. So, you know, the ground beef that we made, the avocado on top that just makes it nice on your palate. And don't get me started about the chipotle crema that we put on top here that just wrapped it all together. And there's actually crunchy. The corn tortilla that we fried in the chili oil brings it, you know, to a different league, a different level of your taste buds. Again, please like and subscribe if you wanna see more videos like this and stay hungry, everyone. Thank you.